Double hook. Add the cross on the end. Okay, add the hook on the end. Okay. Good, cross on the end. Yeah. Nice, good, yeah. So I'm going to go and slow it and go to the throat. So now what we're trying to do when you slip it, is try not to turn from here. But you try and turn from that. That's what I mean by that. So when you turn, when you try and get on the ball foot like this, you turn that hip away. So that what you're effectively oh. doing is you're holding that side up. Because what you try to do, you know, eventually, but technically, I'm in here, I'm from my jab. You've managed to slip it. But I'm saying, then when you do that, by turning that hip, you can come back and throw a punch. Jab cross slip punch, yeah? Nice, good. Yeah. Add the hook cross on the end. Nice, good. One more. That little spring, yeah? Alright, we're going to go jab cross, hook cross. Okay, so we go slow, we go. I'm going to do that slip, slip, roll underneath. Alright, so we're going to go. So again, just to get you, get the four punch, we go. Slip, slip, duck. Yeah, underneath, and then put the cross on the other side. Alright, the reason I want to do it is to get, get them hips here. Yeah. Trying to get same again, think about it from your feet. So whenever you're doing that slip, if you slip that jab, turn that hip. Yeah? Then turn the hip the other way, throw it through. See how the position you get yeah. there? So imagine even if you were going to do a hook from that position. Yeah. That lower position there you've got is awesome. Yeah? Yeah. Back under the top, roll underneath, load it up. Okay. Yeah? You don't have to go quick. Four punches. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Good. Almost think of that bow and arrow effect. So you're chucking that jab, yeah. throwing that shot, bang, and you step in. So you just throw the jab nice and wide. Again. Right, now we're going to do it one more. Now we're going to throw a jab cross, but think about the cross. Nice and light jab, let the cross go. Yeah, then okay, nice and light jab. Good jab. Jab again. One more. Add the cross. Good, again, yeah, jab. Jab cross. Jab cross. Okay, jab cross. Good, yeah. Okay, on that whole cross on the end. Alright, so the same as my feet slow. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah, so that jab cross nice and easy. Think again, because every time you're throwing shots at me when you're throwing the jab, I'm still gonna have to do something about it. Yeah. I can't just stand there and think, alright, well I'm waiting for it. I'm still thinking and moving around. So you sort of get yourself in position, moving my hands around to do it. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Alright, so try that, try that out of the pocket. You did before. Yeah? <laughs> so again, what you need to do is when you catch it, elbow, imagine your elbow touches the top of your hip. As soon as you feel it, turn, sink in with it. So imagine you're taking that impact, the turn, so that's it, turn it there. Then as you pop up, bang, yeah? So we'll go jam cross, out of the pocket, up the cross, so we'll go. Good. That's two movements. Don't do either of it as one. If it's one movement, as I throw that shot to the body, if you mistime it and start to throw the uppercut early, and when you catch it in the yes. ribcage, just feel the contact. When you feel the contact, then hit. Yeah? So it's a little catch, then pop it up. Yeah? Yeah? Wow. Yeah? 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 Yeah?